DC Scarabia. Now welcome my friends. Now I think about DC's, you know, WBO welterweight champion Tim Bradley will be making a six million dollar guaranteed purse for his rematch with Manny Pacquiao that's coming on April the twelfth at MGM Grand in Las Vegas, Nevada. Now it looks Bradley uh keen in uh you know on the ten million that he was reportedly asking for to fight Pacquiao a second time. Now Pacquiao will be getting twenty mil. Now Bradley beat Pacquiao by a controversial speed decision the last time they fought in 2012. Now Pacquiao was so controversial that it takes a lot of uh, takes a lot of interest, you know, in the rematch because it's a fight that really isn't necessary, really. So you know the thing about it is, is uh, you know Pacquiao already beat Bradley. Boxing fans might not like the idea of having to pay to see an unnecessary rematch, but if it were a free fight, then fans wouldn't care too much. But the fact is, they gotta pay again. <laughs> You know, it's not like Roy Jones Jr. fighting on Mandela Griffin the second time when he had totally dominated him in the first fight before being disqualified when he hit Griffin after he had taken the knee. But it's also possible that Bradley had to be so with top rank to get the fight. His top rank president, uh, Todd DeBoeuf, said that top rank Cole has a long term relationship with him regardless of uh, whether or not he wins or loses in the fight. You know, I don't know about you, but it sounds to me like a Bradley was on with top rank in order to get a fight with Pacquiao. If that's the case, then Bradley can case good by any chance of him ever getting a fight against Floyd Mayweather while well, he's in the top rank because Mayweather won't agree to do the fight. Now, Mayweather has mentioned, I'm sorry, not Mayweather, Bradley has mentioned, uh, you know, he wanted to fight Mayweather on many occasions, but he shouldn't bother wasting his time talking about the fight if he has resigned. Now, either way, it probably doesn't matter, but if Bradley loses badly at Pacquiao on the April 12 rematch, and Bradley's better off staying with top rank than leaving them. Now, my staying with top rank Bradley will have a chance to fight Pacquiao a third, fourth, and probably fifth time, given that Bob Arum doesn't have a lot of options for the Pacquiao fight. But if Bradley were to leave the company on the, um, you know, of the back of uh, defeat the Pacquiao, then he won't get the Mayweather fight, and he'd have to pick a point, you know, pick up part these uh, Golden Boy Promotions uh, fighters like Keith Thurman and uh, Danny Garcia.